So what were you doing as a five-year-old? Our next guest was already performing solo concerts at places like Ravinia. A year later, she was at the White House performing for the president. And now at the ripe old age of 11, she's releasing her <laughs> debut album, Diversity, produced by music legend Quincy Jones, by the way. From Rockford, welcome Emily Bear. Hi, Emily. Hi. You're old now. You've done so much. <laughs> Where did your love for playing piano come from? Um, I don't know. I just, it, I guess it's always been a part of me, and like I just started playing, and I don't think I could leave it. Yeah. So, do you remember the first time you sat down at the piano and played? Kind of. You do? I remember some parts, but it kind of feels like I've always been playing. Yeah. yeah. But you're fam you come from a musically inclined family too, right? Yeah. My sister plays harp and piano. My uh, brother plays saxophone, guitar, and piano. Right. Do you and play any other instruments? Uh, I tried playing the French horn in band. <laughs> At school? I bring it home once, and my family told me I sounded like a dying duck. And I like, oh. <laughs> well, I think you got the piano down. Did it just click right away? Was it something that just made sense to you? Well, kind of, because I like composing, and like they say in orchestrating, so they say like piano is like the universal instrument because it sounds like almost every instrument in the orchestra. Yeah, I would say that she likes composing. I have all of her music books. She wrote all of this yes. right here. And you actually play by memory too? Yeah, I read and I play by ear. So 45 pages, you can just remember how to play it and play it. Or she can hear a tune, just her ear hears it and she can automatically just play it. So if I like made up a song, you could just play it. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Who's Who's the coolest person you've gotten to meet, besides uh, us? <laughs> <laughs> I have to say Quincy. Yeah. He's Quincy just, Jones. Yeah. He's so down to earth and he's so nice. And whenever you're with him, you learn so much. Right. And he just produced and worked on your latest project, didn't he? Yes. The diversity. Yeah. And the song that she's going to be performing in the show is actually called Q and is dedicated to Quincy. Right? Yes. I wrote it for Quincy. Well, just this summer. Okay, so you literally just got back from Asia. You were at summer camp with your friends, having fun for three weeks, and then you start traveling the mm -hmm. world. What was that like? It was very interesting. Some <laughs> of the food in Japan was a little weird. <laughs> <laughs> what was your favorite thing? You didn't try the uh, octopus, did you? No, my brother did. Yeah. yeah too much <laughs> They had, like, eel and squid on a stick with, like, all the little tentacles, and then they had... Um, uh, octopus on a yeah. stick too, like with all the little yeah. tentacles. And then they also had like a whole fish, including the eyeballs and all oh. the bones on a stick. On a stick? It's fish on a stick? Yeah. <laughs> wow. And did you try it all? No. No. Yeah. You're with, you're with me on that one, Emily. <laughs> yeah. I did, I did try some eel. Oh. How was that? It was, it was okay. Yeah. I like the flavor, but the texture wasn't the yeah. greatest. Well, I have to ask you, who do you like to listen to? Um, depends on usually what I'm in the mood for. Okay. Sometimes I listen to, like, jazz or, or um, sometimes I listen to, like, Coldplay or Passion Pit. Yeah. What about One Direction or Justin Bieber? Um, they're not my type, but they're good. <laughs> what, what a lot of your girl says that. <laughs> so, so I know that you got to meet the president. That must have been pretty cool. It was really cool. Yeah? Really? What, were you nervous? Not really. No? Not really, no. It was a lot of fun, though. He was really nice. Yeah. How many hours a day do you spend practicing? Um, depends. Um, like yesterday, I probably only got about, like, 20 minutes in. But some days, like an average, maybe like an hour and a half, two hours. Okay. Or, well, that's just like practicing, maybe like an hour. But, uh -huh. like, I'm always playing music constantly. I could be, like, either writing right. or I could be drilling. How do, you, how do you prepare for a concert or a routine? I mean, what's your routine to get ready for a performance? Um, just work on the music. I That's know. it, huh? Yeah. 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 You what? have a gift. You realize that, right? Yeah. 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 You, think you have a true gift. Thank you. What would you like to do with this gift when you grow up? I would like to be film score. You want to do films? Yes. Great. I see that. That's it. You can do that by the time you're 15. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah well, you'll be done. What is it about the film scores that, that you like so much? Um, I like creating a mood with the picture because, like, if you've seen a movie without the music, like, it takes like half the like the mood away. Right. Mm -hmm. Who's your dream person to collaborate with? 
Probably like John Williams or Hans Zimmer, something like that. Yeah. Really? We were going to bring Justin Bieber out, but since you said... <laughs> 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 well, enough. I, th I think enough talking to Emily. How, what do you think? I think we really like to hear you perform. Sure. Her debut album, Diversity, appeared at number seven on the Billboard charts, but quickly moved to number three on the Billboard charts. So here's Emily Bear performing Q. One more time, Emily Bear.
family, what do your friends think of all of this? Um, I mean, they know it, but we usually just don't talk about it. Yeah. <laughs> Play, watch movies, talk. Do you bring them back souvenirs from when you're traveling the world? Yes. You I do? Just, I brought a couple fans for my friends. All oh, yeah. the fans from Asia. And yeah. And then I brought them, like, these little silk baggy things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Now, I know that you've done a lot of national TV shows. You've done Ellen several times. You've done Good Morning America. Now that you've done our show, as you continue to become a bigger star, you've got to come back and keep yeah. seeing us, okay? Yeah. Promise you're going to come back and perform again? Yeah, it's fun. All right, sounds fun. good. Okay. So great. Emily Bear, 11 years old, from Rockford. Yeah.